Hi, fellas. Ladies and gentlemen, this is who you are looking at. <coughs> Our next two puppeteers are going to introduce you to the world of improv. Yeah, improv company. Keep it going or not quite a month. So yeah, we're not quite a mop. I'm Dan. I'm Parker. Uh, we're going to do improvised puppetry. How many of you here by a show of hands have seen an improvised show before? Ooh, very few. Well, wait, let's do it the other way. Who hasn't seen an improvised show? Yeah, okay. So a lot of you have Has anyone seen an improvised puppet show before? But one guy in the back. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a scripted. We're going to make stuff up. Uh, off the top of our heads, and we're going to do it with puppets. Uh, but <clears throat> the first thing we're going to do is get some help from someone in the audience. Is there someone here who has an interesting story about a scar that they'd like to share? Have got some kind of an interesting scar? <laughs> it won't hurt. Be brave. <laughs> no, no. Yeah. What's your name? My name's Scott. A round of applause. Um, it's one on my finger right here, and I got it when I was working at the Mecca Cafe, which still exists, all and uh, after lunch rush, my manager came out from the back and he had his chef's knife and a carrot, and he said, you ever have a carrot bite before? And he started doing this, so I said, oh, and I picked up my chef's knife and a carrot, and I went, what could you <laughs> it was that slow motion moment where I could see like steak as the whitest thing possible, and then it went. Bleh. It's an interesting scar. <laughs> 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 did, did your manager ever engage you in knife carrot fights or anything? Oh like yeah, that? all the time. No, not all the time, but we did do it a couple times after. <laughs> 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 So what happened immediately after you got your, your, your cut? Did you go have to rush to the hospital? What? Well, it's a little different because I also worked at Cafe Minis, along with Cafe Minis at the time, and some of my waitresses were in there drinking. So I knew they were there when I went in and I showed them, <laughs> dripping on the floor, and they went, <laughs> and then I went and got stitches. <laughs> did you drive yourself? Or no, I just had to walk, walk to the... Outpatient place. Gotcha. Did you go it. back for the rest of your shift after that? Yeah. Uh, yeah absolutely. Oh, yeah. What's your manager's name? It was Paul. Okay. This is back in 93. So, Scott, what we're going to do is we're going to reenact your scar story. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so, here is Scott's scar story. Look, you don't have to be so glum. This isn't Cafe Minis. You know, we're fun here. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess. I just, you know, it's just a lot of chopping, a lot of serving. Not a lot of variety in what I get to do. Minis been the same for a while. Yeah. We need some excitement around here. We need, we need something. Chopping. <laughs> Careful there. <laughs> Look, I, Paul, I don't, I don't mean to sound, you know, upset or anything, but it's just, it's hard to work with you kind of looking over me. You, 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 you have offended my honor. What? I challenge you to a carrot fight. <laughs> my guard! <laughs> a, a carrot, eh? <laughs> Whoa, a chocolate <laughs> carrot! <laughs> back! Back, Varlet! Back! <laughs> I can chop it as good as you. You're skilled in the carrot chopping arts. You've been trained well. <laughs> I'll chop your carrot. Ha ha! You have been chopped. And now I shall chop mine. Chop like it's never been chopped before. Ch ah! 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 <laughs> Do you yield? I yield. I am the Carrot Master! <laughs> Truly you are the Carrot Master. But what will I do with this? Oh, 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 I know exactly what to do. Oh, 
Oh, hey. Hey, check this out. Oh, gross! Cool. <laughs> <laughs> I just get all over the food! It's making the cafe minis more exciting, I'll tell you what. <laughs> well, um, did, did you want to look at it some more? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get some stitches now. Yeah, you should go to the clinic. Good idea. Make sure you come back for your shift. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. So I have. Uh, you can see but the puddle. Don't tell me. Here, fight. <laughs> How'd you know? You get a lot of those. Oh yeah. Um. So when will people learn? <laughs> You gotta pass the time, kill the drudgery. Well, now, right now you're fighting carrots. Pretty soon you're chopping onions, celery. Where does it end? Look, can you fix me up or not? I'll fix you up. But I don't approve of what you do. <laughs> Get out. Fine. Uh, I am gonna have to dock you for that hour you weren't working. <laughs> Catch! Go! On guard! Carrot fight! puppet scene, but at any point in time during our scene, uh, one of you can shout out question period and uh, raise your so hand. Let's say Dan is talking about something. Uh, so anyway, I, I was Question thinking... period. <laughs> yeah, yes. What are you doing with your life? <laughs> Me? Or this guy? I, you personally. Oh, uh, well, I'm, you know, playing with puppets because I didn't announce what I thought I was going to So you can, you can just raise your hand and say question, and you can ask a question either of us, the improvisers, or the puppets, and we will answer you. So to get this going, um, let's have a suggestion of some kind of object from a raised hand. Just any kind of object. Yes? A jackhammer. Jackhammer, thank you. <laughs> That's some quality Jack Cameron. Thank you. you know, when I hired you, a lot of people said, she's 100 pounds. She can never operate a Jack Hammer. She'll just get tossed straight off. <laughs> they were right. Okay. Okay. Hey. So, this doesn't mean you're going to. Fire me. I'll give you another chance. Thanks. Question. Yes. Puppet, why did you hire her in the first place? I saw herself. I saw myself in her. Bill, <laughs> <laughs> well, I really appreciate this. Don't disappoint me. Question time. Yes. <laughs> what made you resort to this job in the first place, Purple Haired Puppet? Oh, it's Sally, but thank you. Um, <laughs> well, you know, I wanted a, a physical job, something where I really felt I could do some work, and, and I don't know, there was just something of Bill in me that I saw. You're almost there. <laughs> you, you know, it, sorry to stop, it just occurred to me that, well, I don't know what I'm digging for. I mean, this hole is now several feet deep, and I, I don't know when I'm supposed to stop or what the purpose is. Oh, you'll know. Was <laughs> it okay. 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 good? Yes. yes. Sally, where do you see yourself in five years? <laughs> still digging that hole? Well, you, it looks like it's going to be still digging in that hole, but I was hoping I could do something more meaningful and physical, perhaps manage other jackhammers. <laughs> 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 Question. Yes. Puppet. Yes. Did you warn her that there might be a gas line under <laughs> I did not warn her of that. Indeed. 
So I hear you need a uh, new jackhammer. <laughs> yeah. What happened to the last one? <sighs> it's a sad story. She uh, retired <laughs> and went to a farm. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, a, a story I heard about my dog, too. <laughs> Could have been the same farm. <laughs> That's what I'm worried about. Um, do you have any more managerial positions? Uh, nope. I, uh, I sit here, I watch the jackhammers, it's a two-man operation. Two-man? Yep, you jackhammer, I watch. <laughs> Did you ever switch positions there? Nope. I see. Um, okay, well... I'm pretty sure we're past all the gas lines. <laughs> the pay is better than anything I've had before, so I think I'll take it. Alright, welcome aboard. Thank you. And that's the jackhammers. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. And there they go, once a wonderful the improv poetry of not quite a mop. Yay! If you too would like to learn how to improvise with puppets, you can join them at Seattle Puppet Jam. You can go to that Facebook page for more informaciones. Not quite a mob. They told me the title came from a line from The Simpsons, as so much of life does. <laughs> Wherein somebody asked Homer, what's a Muppet? And he said, it's not quite a mop, not quite a puppet. <laughs> Thanks, Homer. Making our lives better since 1989.